Every day is a new day. Every opportunity a new possibility. Happiness is just hanging around your doorstep. Grab it, smile at it and welcome it into your life. Let's draw happiness. Hello and welcome to Kolam Podis Draw Happiness. As you all know, Kolam Podis is a happy project. All of us are in the pursuit of happiness and as you know, that's what this show is all about. Let's get on to the ninth day of Draw Happiness. Hormones and happiness are interconnected. Well, yesterday we listed eight ways by which we can get to a happier space and uh, today onwards, we're going to be discussing each of those subjects slightly in detail. Today we start with discussing exercise. Exercise is not just for the body, but also for the brains. Let's list some of our traditional games. If we actually start observing them closely, we will be able to appreciate how much thought has gone into even designing each of these games. Marbles, dive pass or the dominoes, um, pallanguri, gilli danda, hopscotch or apandi, koko, Kabadi, so many games, right? Now, from a mental perspective, you have Pallanguri, so many uh, shell-based games. The list can actually go on. Now, exercise does not only keep us fit and healthy, it also prevents the body from disease and degeneration. Now, all these exercises that we talked about is great for the brain, coordination, agility, dexterity, endurance, and the list can just go on. Now, when we exercise, our body tends to release hormones. This exercise, as I said, is both physical and brain related. What are these hormones? Growth hormones. These are referred to as human growth hormones. What do human growth hormones uh, impact the growth of the body? Taller, leaner, weight, all this falls under that category. This growth hormone is released in the pituitary gland. Testosterone is another hormone that gets released, typically referred to as the male hormone. What many people don't know is this hormone is also responsible for the overall muscle development and bone mass. Insulin and thyroid hormones are also released while exercising. Exercise can assist the brain in releasing hormones. Now let's look at some of these. Dopamine. Dopamine is referred to as the feel-good hormone. This feel-good hormone gets released when the brain feels it's received a reward. Then you have serotonin. Serotonin is again a feel-good hormone, but it focuses on stress control. And then we have endorphins. Endorphins are both for pain relieving as well as stress control. Now, among all the traditional games, we can also include Colum as a game. Colum is great for the brain. It is also a phenomenal stretch when you draw the Colum, either by bending down or squatting or by sitting down and stretching your spine in all ways Kolam also falls under the category of exercise. So, on that note, let's go to today's Kolam, Nitya. Nitya, she who is constant. Reminding you to think that happy thought before we get on to drawing today's Kolam.
So did you like the design, Nitya? She looks complicated, but she's not, just like our lives. If you like this column, you know what you need to do. Press the like button and leave us a comment. Feedback always is motivating. Secondly, draw Nitya, take that picture and share it with us on our website columnporder.com under Draw Happiness. We have created a platform where you can journal your column and a happy thought every day to ensure you're a happier person 108 days later. Like I say every day, happiness is a chain reaction and it starts with you. If you're happy, people around you are happy and eventually the society becomes a happier space. So join me in my quest. And now on to our next ritual in Draw Happiness, picking the happy thought. Anu Balan says, a video conference call with my entire family. That is so true. So many of us were dependent on technology and video calls during the testing times of Corona, right? Thank you, Anu. And yes, your thought becomes the happy bird of the day. And our little birdie Nitya is happy to take off. Our pretty little Nitya has joined her friends. On that note, life is beautiful if we choose for it to be. I'll see you tomorrow in the next episode of Draw Happiness. Until then, Kholam Fodit.